How to replace the thermal paste in a laptop. At the request of fans, today we're replacing the thermal paste on the SST UF Gaming A15 FA506. Let's reduce the CPU temperature by 4.6 degrees Celsius in 6 simple steps, easily improving your laptop's performance. Tutorials for replacing and upgrading thermal paste on laptops are available in the main tutorial collection on our homepage. You can also comment with your model if you need specific guidance. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Step 1. Get tools ready. Many tools are needed to replace the laptop's thermal paste. Apart from the thermal paste and thermal paste cleaning wipes, some gadgets can help you to disassemble the laptop much more easily. If you don't want to buy them separately, you can find our total solution combo in our profile. Step 2. Remove the laptop case and battery. Before you start disassembling the computer, it's highly recommended to wash your hands or wear gloves or an anti-static wristband to eliminate static electricity. With the laptop placed face down, use a PH0 screwdriver to remove the 11 screws on the bottom cover. It's advised to use a magnetic mat to avoid mixing or losing screws. Prepare a triangular pry tool and spudger. Insert the triangular tool from the side and slide it around the edges. Once the pry tool is inserted, gently lift up to remove the bottom cover. After opening the back cover, use two spudgers to disconnect the power cable by pushing both sides outward. After removing the power, press and hold the power button for 15 seconds to discharge residual electricity. Step 3. Remove the heatsink and old thermal paste. Use a spudger to disconnect the fan's power cable. Remove the cable near the left fan and the power cable for the right fan. Remove the screw securing both fans. Loosen the screws on the cooling module in a diagonal sequence. Use a high-quality screwdriver, such as the Cooling Monster Combo 01, and apply vertical pressure to prevent stripping the screws. Carefully lift the cooling module and place it beside the laptop. To clean the old thermal paste more efficiently, we recommend using Cooling Monster Clean 01 Thermal Paste Cleaning Wipes. If you're worried about getting your hands dirty, you can use the disposable gloves included in our kit. Here you can see, the thermal paste on the processor has dried up after years of use, reducing its cooling efficiency. It needs timely replacement. Step 4. Clean the fan. We use an anti-static brush and compressed air for cleaning. Use the anti-static brush to clean the dust on the fans and heat pipes. When using compressed air, maintain a small distance to avoid spraying liquid. Compressed air can effectively clean the fine details and significantly improve dust removal efficiency. After completing the cleaning, don't forget to clear dust from the back panel. Step 5. Apply thermal paste. Here we used Cooling Monster Cold 01 High Performance Thermal Paste. Apply an appropriate amount of thermal paste on the surfaces of the CPU and GPU. After applying the thermal paste, you can use the spatula to evenly spread out the thermal paste and remove the excess. You can also use the P-Size method if you like. Step 6. Reassemble your laptop. Reassemble everything in reverse order. Reconnect the right fan and plug in the power cable. Reattach the left fan and reconnect its cable. Secure the screws in a diagonal sequence, tightening them partially at first, then fully to avoid over-tightening. Reattach the screw securing both fans. Finally, reconnect the power cable to the motherboard. Close the back cover, secure the clips, and reinstall the 11 screws on the back.
follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster and let us know which laptops to demo this process with next.